Well, my name is Brian Gottschalk. I'm a 60-year-old farmer, I guess. Run about 130, 40 cows. And uh, this thing, fast catch, is quite the deal for an older person that can't move very much anymore. We've caught about 15 of them so far. Haven't had an issue with them, any of them. Uh, it, it's pretty simple. It's fast. Uh, tagged the other day, tagged four of them in less than 15 minutes. Worked them and we were out of there. Easy on and off. It takes less than a minute to take it off. Put it on. Uh, can't beat that. We'll take it off when we don't really need it and you got to go tag some calves, you just slap it on and go. Well, you've always got some of that act up and uh, you try to grab them and throw them on the back of a pickup where she tries to crawl on. Uh, or if you get them, we used to work them right outside of the side by side on the ground or along a pickup and you get a cow that even though she think you think she's halfway decent, they'll come up and they'll knock you around. Luckily, I've never been beat down in the ground, but uh, I really don't want to see that. So, you know, before if we had a cow that we couldn't handle, and I calve everything out in the open. It's out in old CRP grass. We don't bring anything in unless uh, they have trouble. Uh, or we've got a really bad storm coming in. But, uh, so they're out in, out in the open. Uh, before, if you had a mean one, you couldn't handle, you let him go. Uh, we'd end up with 15, 20 calves come April when we brought them in to work them and before they went to grass. Well, out there you know which calf they all, cow they all belong to. When you bring them in, they all look the same. So then you have to start pairing them. This way here, uh, we should be able to keep everything tagged and up to date. And uh, that'll save a lot of time in the spring when we work them. Well, I had a guy come stop by today. Uh, he asked about it and I said, uh, it's well worth your time to check in, I said, because uh, uh, it's worth having if you're going to tag calves. The biggest thing is if one of them cows hits you, you end up in the hospital, it's going to cost a whole lot more than what this thing costs. And you only have to get hit one time for that to sink in. So uh, anybody I would Anybody that's running cattle, I've told that, you know, you ought to check into it. Mm -hmm.